Hi, I'm Arden Vegas for the USB-C Masters. This is day two. I balled yesterday morning, got off to a decent start. And today I'm balling in the evening, which means I have to go through a challenge that we all face sometimes. I have to wait around the entire day to ball. So how do you want to prepare for this um, when you're balling in the evening? Because it's very easy to to be in a bad spot physically, mentally, when you have to go around waiting to ball all day. It's very easy to get fatigued from doing too much physically, but at the same time, it's very easy to get very tired uh, from doing nothing. So for me today, I'm right now I'm outside enjoying a little bit of the nice Vegas weather. Um, so for me, I'm gonna, I'm gonna take it easy. I don't wanna um, fatigue myself by going on a long run or uh, doing something a really hard exercise or anything. I don't want to be in a bowling center for 10 hours before I for a bowl that's gonna fatigue my mind. Uh, but at the same time I'm not gonna just lay in bed. I'm gonna do a little bit of exercise, light exercise, something that's not gonna make me sore, something that's not gonna make me tired, but it's gonna keep my body going, get all the systems working, get me uh, um yeah get me get me a little bit warmed up to ball um gonna um watch a little bit of the bowling uh some of it on ball tv maybe some in the in the bowling center see how they're playing the lanes today same pattern as yesterday so i kind of know what i want to do but it's always nice to see if someone is doing something different how scores are developing like if uh, if they just if the lanes just play a little different today it's nice to know that before we start practice so um so yeah I, as i said i think i'm gonna i'm gonna be outside a little bit get a little bit of fresh air get some sunshine um and then can do a, a little bit of light exercise i think that's the that's the way to do you gotta stay active without tiring yourself out um, obviously the other thing is uh, i have to eat fairly decent so um drink a lot of water get some good meals in today while we're uh, waiting to bowl and try to get a, a good dinner in before we bowl about 6 30 which is kind of an awkward time because it's a little early to eat dinner but at the same time we're probably gonna bowl for like four hours so i'm not gonna wait until afterwards to have dinner so early dinner and then maybe a snack or two while we're bowling banana or something like that so yeah so that's uh, that's kind of how i would deal with um, with having to wait around all day to ball uh, it's very easy to get angsty and uh, anxiety from thinking about all the things that you want to do the things that can go wrong so you kind of start overthinking things i kind of know what my game plan is going to be as i said i'm going to watch a little bit of the bowling that might change my game plan a little bit but uh, I'm not gonna overthink it. I kind of know what I want to do and then um, I see how the lanes play and how the lanes transition. I'm gonna adjust to that. So um, keep it very sim simple, very relaxed and just go out and make a bunch of good shots. Make sure I'm uh, warmed up well before uh, warm-ups, practice, whatever you want to call it. Uh, as it is easy to get a little stiff when um, when you're bowling in the evening, um, especially when I'm getting a little older. That wasn't an issue when I was 21, 22. So, uh, so yeah, so that's, uh, that's kind of how I, I do it when I bowl uh, later in the day and have to wait around all day. So um, yeah, gotta stay focused, gotta stay fresh. And uh, hopefully today or tonight will be a very good day. So thanks for watching and I hope you could use the device if you sometimes pull in the evening after work or whatever um, make sure you stay fresh make sure you um, you get warmed up well so you're not stiff get all that tension from from the day out of the body and uh, yeah enjoy go ball have, have fun and uh, tune back for more videos here on YouTube